Hey everybody, Mudman here, Jason Mud. Thank you guys for listening, watching to the Yes Brands channel. I uh, hope that, that we're bringing you something that's going to help improve your life in some way. There's something that I wanted to talk about this morning that I think is so, so, so important. And it's something that's overlooked in a lot of people's lives. I know me personally, it was something that was overlooked in my life for a long, long, long time. It took me a while to, to really get this because there's a lot of emotion uh, that, can be, that can be tied to this. But I think we've all grown up with, with parents that at some point have kind of warned us about the people that we hang out with. You know, don't hang out with, with Johnny or Susie. Uh, because they're bad influences on you. And, and and I know for me as a kid, I would rebel against that. You know, oh, you tell me not to hang out with somebody and that would that would make me want to, to pursue that because, because I think people are just defiant in nature in, in a lot of ways until, until you kind of come to a realization that, you know, the people, you know, so, sometimes people really are looking out for you and people do know more than you. You know, you don't know what you don't know, Right. But if you really think about it, you are the product of the five people that you hang out with the most. Now, it might, might be five, might be four, might be seven. But regardless, the, the, the reality of, of who you are is that you take on the traits of the people that you surround yourself with. So... If you're hanging out with people that that are partying all the time, you're gonna you're gonna be partying all the time. That's what you're gonna want to do. That's the FOMO, the fear of missing out. If you don't do the activities that your friends are doing, you're gonna have that that FOMO, and and you're gonna want to partake in what they're doing because that's the life that you see that is that is happening. That's not the life for everybody. So, so take that to another end. If you hang out with, with, with people that are really successful in business or in relationships or in, in just in, in different areas of life, guess what? You're going to take on those traits. You are going to start to learn from them because that, that's really how we work as humans. We work by seeing other people do things and, and, and learning from them. And, and I think that this goes back to, to that idea, you know, everybody's a leader. Everybody in this world is a leader. It just, you might not be a good leader. You might not be leading for the right things, but I guarantee you, you're leading somebody. So look at your circle of friends. Look at the people that you surround yourself with in life and ask yourself, are you being led by this person, that person, Johnny, Susie, Rick, Smith, whatever? Look at the people around you and look at how you're influencing their lives as well because I guarantee you there are people in your life that are looking up to you in some way and are mimicking in some way some of the things that you're doing. Again, this just goes back to, to how people are. And as much as we, we, are, we are all unique, we are absolutely all unique, but we're all the same in so, so many ways. That's why marketing works. That's why, that's why advertising works. That's why you can, you can send mass messages to people there there is a connectedness within us uh, that that you you just you can't ignore it I mean you you know we've all felt the energies of people on some level you know when there's somebody that's a really you just have you ever heard that phrase you just get a bad vibe when you walk in a room you know that's that's from the energies of of the people that are that are in there and and it's an unspoken thing 
but it's it's there. It's really interesting. You just have to, you know, you've got to, it's like a radio. You know, if, if, if your radio is in tune with, with the certain frequencies, which, you know what a frequency is? You know what a radio station is? It's just an energy. It's an energy that's vibrating in, in the air. It's all around us. And, and your radio is just in tune to receive that message. Notice when you put it on a radio station, you get it dialed into that station. You don't get, you don't get mixed messages because it's only in tune to that frequency, to that energy level. It's very interesting. So, so look at the people that are in your life. Look at, look at how they are impacting you and and really I would implore everyone to do this and this isn't to alienate people this isn't to 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 say get rid of your friends this isn't you know because there there's something to be said about relationships but you might want to think about about how you're spending your time with certain people is it really to your best interest because people don't always have your best interest at, at heart when when they're hanging around you. And you've got to think about that for yourself. You know, I, I know in my life, I can look back at, at certain friendships that I've had that have been super destructive, not because they were bad people in any way, but because I became a, a, a not as good of a person when I was around them. I took on some of their traits. I wanted to live a certain lifestyle in a certain way that that just it didn't work for me. It it and it took me a long time to realize that that one it wasn't good for me and that two I could be a better person getting out of that type of a relationship. And it was tough. It's it's so so tough. But it's so, so worth it. And not that you pick your friends based on, based on their success level, but when you have an idea of what you want in life, you tend to, you tend to, to, to interact differently with, with, and better with certain types of people. You know, like attracts like. There's, there's the, that whole law of attraction. And I'm, I'm a firm believer in this. You know, you, you get what you put out. So, if you want to be a positive person, you can't hang around negative people all the time. You can't hang around somebody that's going to that's gonna point out everything that's going wrong if all you want to do is, is focus on the good. And conversely, you're not going to change them. You know, somebody somebody really has it in their in their head that that you know everything's gloom and doom, which the world's not. The world's pretty awesome. I'm pretty psyched to be alive. You know, you know the chances of being a, a human are like one in four trillion. The, just the chances of being born, let alone being born healthy, it, it's it's incredible. So I'm grateful every day that I'm alive. But there's some people that 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 don't see. The, the awesomeness that is just the simplicities of life. And, you, you know, you can't change anybody. Every, you, it, it, people have to change for themselves. So, don't hang around people thinking that, that, you, might, that you might change them. Because it, it ain't going to happen if they don't want to. So, that's my rant for today. Think about the people in your life. Think about the five people that you hang out with the most think about how they they lift you up think about how you lift them up and you might need to do some cutting you know some not everybody makes the team and and when when you're you're looking at the team of life the team of your circle it's important that you pick and choose who you who you associate with it matters it matters to you it matters to 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 how you're going to be matters to what you're going to do. So have a wonderful day, everybody. Thank you so much for listening to this. I would appreciate it so much if you would leave a review, share this with your friends. We all know somebody that, that 
that could use a little bit of inspiration and and check out the rest of the content that we have at yeslouisville.com lots of stuff is going to be changing on that so bookmark it come back often and uh, we'll chat soon thanks everybody Whoa.